okay? Is that everything? <laughs> yeah. Just mind your head when you go back under the foot. Why are you doing that again, Danny? We've done that once. Exactly, now it's broken over it. No, it's about 500 grand. So okay, so we've, we've got the best part of a kilo of mints. Oh, okay. How many buns you got? I've got six. I've oh, got, six. Yeah, and I've got loads. So I've got some oven bottom muffins for oven breakfast. Oven bottom. Oven. I know, that's what I thought. I knew you'd appreciate hot that. Hot bottom. Hot Love bottom. A bit of hot bottom. Anyway, I'm trying to make a serious Oh, you're rolling, video. sorry. You're rolling. <laughs> hello. Hello and welcome. <laughs> John's had half a bottle of beer. <laughs> yeah, he should do hello, you do Anne, and I'll be welcome. No. Hello, Anne, welcome. What are you doing? But is that not, that's going right through. It's, it's artistic. artistic. It's going darling. right through it's artistic. you. It's artistic. It's when you, cutting when you, you in half. 15,000 subscribers. Looks like it's growing out of your shoulder. How many have you got like now? you, John, 15? it's going right through me. Why they call me Vindaloo John. <laughs> hello and welcome. Thanks for clicking on this video. Uh, three of us are, have met up. This is John, this is Rob, and uh, we've met up at... Get my trousers off. Yes. <laughs> Don't just talk amongst yourselves for a second. We've met up at the, sake, at the secret pond for an end of summer camp mm. and catch up over a few beers. Yes. Nothing serious going on, no serious bushcraft. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> I don't, know. Don't look at me. <laughs> no serious content. A uh, few beers. We had a nice little, nice little journey in. Through the uh, through the jungle, and um, and here we are. It's a beautiful little spot, isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely. You guys haven't been here before. No, no, not been invited before. Anyway, yes, a few beers. We'll let him talk. Bye. A few beers and some catching up is going to happen. That's about it. Uh, so I'll film bits and pieces, and uh, we've got some nice food to eat tonight and tomorrow morning. This location is is beautiful. Nice little bowl in amongst a load of fields in Hampshire. We got permission to be here. I know the landowner here. So, happy days. We'll um, catch up later. Gonna pitch a tent in a minute and get a cup of tea on. Would you like to try a piece of uh, cocaine chocolate? This is the uh, Shocker Cola. Whoops, Shocker Cola. And this is the uh, the milk chocolate one. I think it is, John. So what is that then, Rob? Explain again. Apparently, in uh, in the war, the Germans used this to keep uh, spirits up, and it was apparently. Laced with cocaine. Couldn't you use it as hot chocolate? Can you melt it? Mmm. It's quite pleasant. Tastes like a um, quality street triangle. Not for me. Big 
gust of wind. Big gust of wind. Oh, I've got so much room. I'm in the way. You've got some um, kind of rolling in there. Look like some arms. Now, here is where we discover the problem. Now, the problem is that, again, again. So I was pitched over with John, but uh, decided to move so that we've got more room for socialising later. I'm just on this little <laughs> mini peninsula looking out over the water, which is quite pretty. It's not the flattest spot, and it's a bit lumpy and bumpy, but I've done what I can with it, moved a few sticks and stones. And I'm going to leave the rain fly off for now, because it's going to be nice tonight, hopefully. So, um, yeah, we'll just leave it like that. Unless it rains, in which case I'll panic and put the fly on. Rob's using a jungle hammock, which he's uh, pitching in the bivy style. Yes, which, uh, I may have forgotten a few critical parts to it, but yeah, we're all right. He's, he's forgotten how, but it's getting there. <laughs> oh, Don't fall thing. over me. Yeah, there you go, I told you he would. <laughs> and John's in his train tent. Mountain Hardware Viperine 2. There you go, that's what it's called. And uh, yes, he's got the very best spot here. The one that I always take. Isn't that nice of me, John? Very nice. Thank you, Dan. You're so kind. I owe you. That's a nice tent. It is. It's a great tent. Weird looking, but nice. Yeah, and with the with the fly on, it just sheds um, rain and wind like there's no tomorrow. Yeah. the last couple of trips I've been on where I've been on the Therma Rest, you know, super skinny mat. I've got myself a treat tonight. I've got the, uh, whatever it's called, the uh, 140 um, Trekology Wide Boy Mat. So, I've got a, effectively a proper bed tonight, which is nice. Bought this pump, the, uh, the bigger version of the tiny pump. I can't remember what it's called, but it's got the light built in and all that sort of thing. Yep. Nice. Bed ready. Uh, hang this up, ready for later as well. It's called, I remembered, it's called the Max Pump 2 Pro, I think. Here, aren't we? So if I hang that here for later, I might pull that down a little bit. What the fuck? I just shit myself. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. well, you might want a stronger branch. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> I was trying to get it. Uh... You're in a pump, man. Oh, I've got one of them. Are they the uh, right aid or first aid or? It's called Lucy. Oh, no, I haven't got a blow up one called Lucy, but I've got pretty much the same thing. Okay, so we're all set up. 
Everybody is done. Rob is done as well. His now actually looks quite cool. Does it? You've had too many beers. It doesn't really. I'm just saying that to make him feel better. But uh you whispered something here. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was, it was seductive. Yes. We've got uh, we've got beer tasting. John has got special beers for the night. Or for this bit. What's this one? This is uh, Siren, you. the Grateful Eights. Amazing. 8% double IPA. Ooh, somebody's falling off their chair. It smells really lovely. It's like great, is it grapefruity? Yeah, it's, uh, it's one of those yeah. things. It's great, it's, it's like a... Mm. Cheers. Cheers, yeah. Cheers, nice Good to health, see you both. Sorry, I didn't get the memo on the uh, foldable cup. <laughs> That's strong, isn't it? <laughs> Wowzers. Mm. Nice. I'm glad we're sharing a can. Well, that was the idea. Didn't really fancy, yeah. And it's necking it, is it? <laughs> That's a supping one, mate. Yeah. <laughs> so, long story short, 1500 quid more later, be fixed. But they're saying there's some other bits I want done. They said, no, it's going to have plenty of impact. And it's not on the warranty. So your warranty's just gone. I'm like, so I'm in discussions with the dealer I bought it from. And I said to him, back in the seats. This one it's like, oh, they're there. So I don't know how they work out leakage, but you know, it doesn't, it's not, it's not, it's not it's um, Yeah, it's just nice to have a, a little break. A bit of it, I've got him actually knocking on someone's door and begging for water. I filmed <laughs> it, covertly filmed it. He knocked on someone's door and asked for water. It was getting dire, wasn't it? Yeah. It had like a sip water. left and it was boiling. And we just crossed the blooming desert. Oh, the goodness. desert. It was awful. <laughs> Imagine walking on tea shingle for about a day. Oh. Uh, yeah, we're not having a fire on the ground. We have a. Uh, we have a. <laughs> we have a bush box you know with this. us. Oh, I'm going to persevere. You've got no chance. You know that. We've got a bush box with us to cook dinner on. We've got some uh, meat for burgers, coleslaw and chilli cheese. I'm going to get that on in a minute, yeah. but I can sit for a second because I've worn myself out. Ah. And my chair's sinking already. Yeah. Cup's empty because I've got a chimpanzee here. You've lost your bits on the end, mate. I know. I lost oh. them about a week after I got it. I've lost one because of you. <laughs> From that place we camped by the river. Up and down. Oh. Keep going. What's keep going. Saying? I like that. Yeah, keep going. Chimpanzee double IPA. Oh, nice. Oh, it's just, just, just like half of what you gave me before, sir. 8.2% again. Me. Thank you very much. A bit more. Someone's going to be tipsy. That smells really uriny. Uriny. Cheers. Cheers, boys. Don't worry, I'm just pour mine. You, you two go right ahead. Okay. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I actually prefer that to the other one. Yeah. Or maybe I'm just more drunk. It's stronger. Drunk. Yeah, don't bother cheersing right. me then. Cheers. I thought you just did it while I was pouring. You can. Now these are great, these little bush, bush boxes. We were just talking about them. I used to have one, but uh, I had to sell it. Just didn't use it enough. They are great though. So I'll just throw stuff in. putting on the gloves of doom because I've got no real way of washing my hands so I'll keep the keep the meat away from myself meat. so what's this John this is this is veal rose veal and this is beef beef oh oh Easy.
So we're just going to mix the two meats and then try and get six burgers out of it. Yeah, you might as well chuck some in, John. In the bird's nest. Oh, yeah. Thank you. A bit of salt. Bit of nothing. <laughs> what is that garlic? Garlic. Lovely. They're not, they're not going to be massive. isn't it? So juicy. Oh, that is lovely. Lovely burger, guys. <sighs> mm. Oh, it's a messy oh. bum. <laughs> oh, okay, you might end up eating some of it. Round one. Oh, that good. Oh, that chilli cheese is chilli-ish, isn't it? Wow. Mmm. This thing. That's better, I must say. That's good. <laughs> that was exceptional. It, my eyes have stopped hurting now. You don't look at it, so I'm not looking at it. Yeah, funny that, isn't it? Yeah, Maybe we should move right it over my there. Seat is. <laughs> it's right in front of me. Oh, well, this is fun, isn't That'd it? Do then, wouldn't it? Can I go home now? God, Jesus. Can now you won't be able to see anything. Put oh. it down there, pointing at you two. No, not me. I don't want to be in it. Oh, I mean, turn it off. Turn it in. Nice to catch up with the boys again. <sighs> yeah, good food. A little bit of wine. Feeling pretty good now. It's about midnight and um, time for some sleep. Got to get up and cook.
cook a cook a breakfast in the morning. So um, yeah, going to get my head down now. The other two have turned in. I've left the rain fly off. The weather says 10% chance of rain, so 90% chance of it being dry. Going to take those odds, I think. Pretty confident that it'll be okay. And it'll be nice. There's been good stars tonight sitting out by the fire. So um, once I turn these lights out, I should be able to see the stars above my head. So that'd be nice. So I'll say good night and uh, I'll see you for breakfast in the morning. Good night. and see if I can blag a coffee. I heard the kettle boil. John's whistly thing went off, so there may be some hot water going. Ah, uh, proper good morning. A bit more awake now. I've uh, had a cup of coffee, dug a hole next to a tree, and... Uh, Feeling good about life now. We're, uh, we're gonna have breakfast cooked on the uh, firebox. What do we got? We got Cumberland wheels, Cumberland. sausages, like the roundy ones. That's Legs. a technical term. Big sausage. Some big puffy muffins. Big puffy muffins and eggs? Yeah. Oh, sausage and egg McMuffin. There you go. Yeah, how did you gentlemen sleep? Jesus, yeah. John, you've got a big sausage. <laughs> Mine are pathetic next to yours. I did say it was big. Gee whiz. Why is that? It's like a good dinner plate. Show the boys and girls. Look at that. I said I had a couple of them in my freezer to bring, so we have one each, and mine are half that size. Well, we'll, we'll shazzy, shazzy. Yes. You sleep all right, John? Yeah, really well. No, uh, no back issues in the night. No. No, just had to do some stretches this morning. Oh God. You've been camping, haven't you, over the summer? Yeah, I did the bush rock trip. Yeah. <coughs> I just slept on a roll mat. Yeah. Just by the fire. Nice. Amazing. Oh. Rob's uh, inflatable friend has gone down. <laughs> the, the inflatable tramp. Poor Rachel. <laughs> Poor Rachel. <laughs> Boy from the door. Come here, Rob. How did you sleep? Yes, I've. Yeah, no. yeah. Not bad. Yeah, first four hours were great, and um, and then I woke up. I thought someone was playing the uh, trombone on the tent behind me. <laughs> um, I didn't yeah. hear any of that. I'm surprised that tramp didn't wake you up. <laughs> no, no. I had a dream that Rob woke up with a tramp in his shelter with him. Yeah. It which wouldn't was, have lasted long. Which was weird. It wouldn't have lasted long. Because I'm so gorgeous. Not like that. <laughs> Hot enough for you, chef? Yeah, oh, I know you're a bit funny, aren't you? Otherwise, aren't you? I mean, you don't. Yeah, that's the that is hot. That's massive sausage. Oh yeah! <laughs> giggity giggity. So 
so Rob's on breakfast duty. We've got that massive Cumberland wheel and uh, some eggs and some rolls and stuff. So I'm going to make some coffee, I think, in John's, what's it called? A Kelly kettle, oh, which is a weird device. But, uh, yeah, let's have a look at it, see if I can boil some water. Thank you. Welcome. So that's a double walled whatever. <laughs> that cool. Fill this bit with water. Holds quite a lot, doesn't it? Uh, 1.6 litres, I think. That's not bad. Let's put the plug in. This has uh, got a whistle on it. So we'll know when it boils. My uh, esteemed colleague has pointed out. Make sure the arrow's facing down. And make a little fire in this little ash pan. The eggs on this, but I think it's going to be a bit of a challenge. Okay. Uh, it's like an omelet, and then, uh, oh, you I think you're going to get your wish, John. Is that enough fire in there, John, or not? Yeah, you can put a little kettle on it now, then just drop it down the middle. Oh, I assume yeah. you wanted Good six idea. eggs, but there we go. That's what we're giving them. And then, so a little fire in there, stand that on top, that's so cool, Beautiful. we can drop more down in the, uh, down in the belly of the beast. Into the orifice, Look, there you go, I ruined it for you. If I turn it around that way, it looks a bit more. That looks a bit better, doesn't it? Help yourself to a sausage. Again. So, that's the plan. Pull this out. Oh, that's hot. Pull the plug out. And hold it by the handle and the plug. And in she goes. That sit while I eat my breakfast. Okay, thanks Rob. Sausage and egg bap. Well, it'll do. Mm? It'll do. Nice. Nice flavour Oh, here we go. Yeah, go Where's the safe the place? Off. That's Give safe, isn't it? You're not using the dropping for the use. Oh my god. It's my pants if that handle came off it went into the, uh, the pond. It's actually empty. I was waiting for it to go. <laughs> I'm assuming it's to get the coffee grounds to the bottom of the. Uh, of the ah, it just looks cool. Yes, Does you're it? right. You're right. Getting the coffee grounds down. I think the key is not to be the last person to have. Would Wild Camper like to be first? Yes, I would. <laughs> yeah, because I'm the fussy one. Trying to pour it on my hand this time. If you can, if you can. That's a treat, not having her packet thing. That's not for my customer. Oh. <laughs> I like a breakfast pudding. I have to say. Mm. If you have a nice fry up, it's quite nice having like a chocolate digestive with a cup of tea. <laughs> Just as a pudding. You're a weird guy. Uh, well you have brown bread, two slices. Uh, right? No, no, hang on. Well, well 50-50, but your pudding is the white bread. So you've got the healthy bit. And then pudding is the I mean white. white bread is essentially just cake anyway, isn't it? Yeah. It's nice. Peep show reference. I don't watch it, so they wouldn't know. Who are you talking to? Your camera's rolling, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what you do. You're not sure if you're talking to... Uh, I'm never sure if you're talking to me or you're talking to your valued subscribers. <laughs> Sometimes I'm just talking to myself. Oh, that coffee's all right. It's very nice. It doesn't want to make it too strong. It's very mellow. 
It's, it's the way you sp- yeah. it's the way you spin it. That's uh, all the flavours in it. Should have really made that coffee too strong on the island. Yeah, I do. You use like a whole bag <laughs> yeah. of coffee for two cups of coffee. Ooh, quite a whole bag. It was a generous few spoonfuls. You're not asking for trouble. It was that G- GSI drip thing you were you're using, and you like mounded it like a molehill. Oh, I thought that worked. Poured it through. It's like, oh. <laughs> it Might as well just eat it and I eat was awake out of the bag. for four days. Yes, and I had an unfortunate trouser accident. <laughs> <laughs> Breakfast was spectacular, coffee was nice. Yeah. It's time to go home. That was a nice end of summer. I've had some time off. And, um, yeah, back to work in two days' time. So, a day at home just to get myself organised. And uh, then it's back to the grindstone. But it's been nice, it's been a good summer. I've done quite a lot this year. You know, um, trip to Wales with Warren was good. It was a highlight, and uh, the coastal walk was a highlight, and uh, and that impromptu visit to Dartmoor was really nice as well. So um, yeah, quite pleased with what I've achieved trip-wise because um, during the kind of lockdown period when I couldn't get out, I did kind of say to myself, I need to seize the day a bit more, and you know, get get sort of further afield when I can and that time off in the summer it seemed like I wasn't at home very much as I, I was either on trips or I was on family holiday and um, yeah it's uh, it's been most satisfying but I need to get serious about life again now and um, start earning some money um, so yeah Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for supporting my channel. And uh, see you again. No doubt I'll be out in the woods for uh, the next time you see me. Because I can do that anytime, that's local. But uh, it's been nice to be going further afield over the course of this summer. So thanks again for watching. And um, see you soon. Bye for now. <laughs>